So I hope you had some fun just playing around with the screen, different settings, getting used of it. And I briefly introduced the idea of a ranking system. So under this ranking tab, quick rank. Now our ranking system was only one formula. We ranked all the stocks in our universe based on just this one formula from zero to 100. Now if you click run screen, you'll see this. You'll see this tab here, this column called rank, and it ranks it from zero to 100. You can only see, we said, keep the 20 highest ranked stocks. So you're only gonna see 20 here. But if we just went ahead and selected, put in zero for all, now go to the rules and turn off this rule. Click the little green circle. So now it's turned off. Now hit run screen again. Here you're going to see all roughly 2000 stocks ranked from zero to 100. And you can sort them. So if I was to say, let's look at the very lowest ranked stock, NVTA. Hover your cursor over the 3M, so a chart over the last three months, you'll see that it went from $11 to $5.49. Price fell in half. Okay, let's sort it the other way. High peak energy. We look at the chart, it went from, looks like $17 to $32.40, so price has roughly doubled. That's the ranking system concept. Just ranks all the stocks in your universe from lowest to highest, highest being better. Okay, so from here, let's look at a ranking system. We just want to look at its structure to get the idea in our head before we go ahead and design our own. So click on the Research tab. Click on Ranking. Under Components, Ranking. Oops, didn't save my work. Very important. Research, Components, Ranking. Now you'll see two tabs, Ranking Systems. These are ones that I designed. P123 ranking systems, they give you 49 stock ranking systems and some are very good. Core investing styles, click on that folder and you'll see here they have value, sentiment, quality, momentum, low volatility and growth and core combination, it combines all of these into one ranking system. So hit core combination. So you can see all these folders under core combination. Now the number beside it is how much it's weighting towards each component. We can see that the quality component is weighted most heavily. 30% of this ranking system score is weighted towards quality. And the least is towards momentum, sentiment, and low volatility. You can click on each folder and each subfolder to drill down to look at the actual formulas themselves. or you can hit the expand and collapse button to just open up everything at once. For example, low volatility. You open it up and you see that there's two subfolders, beta and price volatility. So we click on that and now we can look at each of the formulas. There's three price volatility formulas, 33.3%, so each is equal weighted. And we can go over here to this box and we can just read about what actually the formula is doing. So you can just maybe double click on where it says PCT DEV. Up here it comes up with the formula. PCT DEV, click on full description and just go ahead and read what it is. So just go through, just kind of snoop through the ranking system and just get an idea for the structure. You've got these large concepts, large ideas, you've got themed factors or styles. From there it subdivides them into sensible categories and in each category you'll see that you have individual formulas which just sort of double click upon a chunk of the formula and then you'll see that the actual formula comes up. Okay and oftentimes you'll see full description. So you can just go ahead and just read about each one does. Get a good feel for it and we're gonna come back to this in a minute.